to this new video. I'm really sorry it's really, really late. Um, or I haven't done one in absolute ages. It's because I have been on holiday and I just didn't have any time to put anything online. Um, in the, like, the little bit leading up to my holiday, I was so busy. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to go straight into the video. Um, so this video is a haul, and it, all my haul stuff's in here. It's only small, but I feel like I'm going to have hauls coming out of my ears over the next couple of weeks, because um, I have uh, some clothes, maybe, coming up. Um, definitely some back-to-school slash college stuff going on, um, which will be another haul. Uh, so yeah, there will be hauls coming out of my ears, I think. But um, yeah, it should be good. Anyway, I'm going to carry on. So... First things first, I I bought everything while I was away, so it's pretty much all in French, because um, that is where I went on holiday. I went to the south of France and into Paris as well, um, but I will try and make sure I can read everything. Um, okay, so the first thing is we went into Sephora in Paris, and yeah. Basically, I only went into Sephora in Paris, and that was the one shop I went into, because I knew what I wanted. And I wanted the Naked palette, the Urban Decay Naked Basics palette, sorry. Um, and this is just the box, but uh, it comes with six colours, and it was... Oh, stuck. Um, it was €25, Euros. <coughs> I'm not too sure how much... It is in uh, like dollars or pounds or anything, <coughs> <coughs> but it looks like this. My voice is going. This has uh, six colours in it. It has a massive mirror as well. I'm just gonna hide that away so, like, I don't know. They are six colours from um, shimmer shades, matte shades, and dark shades, all leading from white to black. Um, they have it's Venus, Foxy. Uh, Walk of Shame, Naked 2, Fate and Crave and I really like this palette um, it's perfect for my uh, makeup bag it's now definitely a makeup essential and because it's Urban Decay I love it <laughs> I don't buy many um, high end products such as Urban Decay or MAC or things like that I, it's very rare for me um, so I got this and I was really happy about it so yeah I bought that. The thing I bought in Sephora was a uh, concealer palette, and it's actually dirty already. Um, but it looks like this. It's a little round palette with four shades or four colours rather. Um, we have nude, leaf, lilac, and sandy. And I kind of mix between nude and sandy um, to get most of my under eye concealer. Um, if not, I'll just use Sandy, which is this one. Um, I basically saw this and was like, oh, I want it, I want it, I want it. Because I always wanted a concealer palette as such. And because I've always had my MAC concealer, which is the Select Moisture. Um, but that's finally running out of me. And I don't really know what to repurchase it because I want to use something different. So I bought this um, in the hope of it being different. And I've really enjoyed it. I put it on when I got back from our shopping trip without any other like foundation or anything on and my mum went where did you put it and I was like yes I did the job right so it works on any skin tone with and without foundation um yeah oh it also came with a little brush but I hate the little brushes it comes with so yeah with that also in Sephora I bought, I bought a new nail varnish because I did go a bit crazy in the nail varnish this holiday, I also bought another one, but that's run out so it's pretty pointless of me showing you. And another one broke, it got so hot the glass snapped, smashed and the whole thing just went to pop really. Um, but So I bought a new uh, nail varnish from Sephora, this one's one of the little sample sizes where you could have gone for a really big round one, but I wasn't too, I like my nail, varnish, nail varnishes small. Um, so I bought this grey colour, it's in Berlin Underground, I thought this was, this. it's just plain grey, I thought this was great for um, the autumn when it comes, which is nothing like now at the minute, <laughs> with, the re with the weather, um, but yeah, I will put that on and show you. 
Okay, and then the last things from Sephora are these three little uh, cream body washes. I saw these in... Oh, it's leaking. I saw this in a little stand and was mesmerised by all the colours. Um, so I got... I have actually used one already. Uh, this one was Blue Brew, which I've used. It was so yummy. I have Cotton Flower and I have Peony. They're like little bubbles. And you just snap the top open. I'm not going to, but and then all the liquid like comes out. But yeah, that was really nice. And they were like 80 cents each, so really, really cheap. And great. Mm -hmm. On the boat home, uh, they have obviously the duty free and everything. Um, so I bought some foundation. This is the L'Oreal the foundation true match, super blendable, blah 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 blah. Um, so I think this is. Another thing I bought was the CK1 Shock for her Eau de Toilette, um, the perfume. It's 100ml, I haven't actually opened it, so I'm going to open it now. The box looks like that. Oh, something's rattling, that's not good. Oh, such a cute ball. So there's the bottle, it's just plain white with the pink shock. Um, and I was really worried that something broke. Doesn't that the little cap that you like press down? Oh, that's so cute. I've never seen that before. But I've I've never bought myself a perfume before, so uh, it's my first one. I'm quite excited. But it's it's really nice, um it's so if I can trying to describe it, it's, it's a sweet floral scent, um, so for the girls that don't like that, don't go for it. But it, it was it was girly and it was my kind of, it was my treat for my birthday which is today actually, um, but it was my treat for myself, so uh, yeah, I bought that. And then last, and then last but not least, um, is something I actually got free, um, I think it was because I bought, spent over a certain amount of money, but I wasn't too sure. Because um, I kind of like went to the till and she was like, oh wait there, wait there, I've got something to give you. I was like, oh okay. Um, this is a Lacombe set. A Lancome set. Um, let's turn that out. Um, and it just comes in a little bag. It's three, four things. Two, three of them are products. I have them right here. Which is really cute. Is the water blue or is it? That's exciting. So yeah, I bought, I got those little three things with a plain white textured flannel as well to apply with or wash face with, and then a white, uh, kind of transparent um, silicone bag to put it all in, and also says a voyage or kit voyage which is French for um, travel kit so yeah that all goes in there and I'll probably use that for a makeup bag as well or something 
so yeah that was really nice and I think if I remember correctly this is worth about £70 so I got that for me so I was really happy about that and that was a great perfect birthday gift from Brittany Fairies Free. Okay, so that's everything for my haul. I told you it was really small, um, but I feel if I do in small section in small bits, it won't be a massive one that's like 25 minutes long or whatever. Um, so yeah, everything I will put down on my blog, so that'll be linked below, um, and I'll give you proper reviews without me rambling on. Um, yeah, so I will see you soon in my next video. Bye!